The next poem was inspired by Manx folklore and by Manxamean Isle of Man, which is where I'm from originally. And it said that um, when fishermen die, they come back as seagulls. So as a Manx person, a lot of my ancestors were seafarers and fishermen. And I really imagine, you know, this being a fisherman is such a manically dangerous job, even more so back then. So I really imagined these ancestors as being real hard nuts, just like I imagine seagulls are real hard nuts, actually. And the poem is called Gull. Above the city's horns, the gull's dirty laughter shatters noon. I've heard them say the gull is a reincarnated fisherman. I look away when he warms his ass on the hot rocks of town roofs. A great uncle once rooted feet on the decks of hatchbatten trawlers, cheeks birched by driving wind, salt chewed eyes, his gloveless palms guided in the nets. The gull picks fights over lunchtime crusts. But once he feasted on the splintered wood of a crow's nest. With every list, his nostrils filled with the ocean's truth. It's a dicey flight between birth and death. Though I've yet to see a gull's brains liquefied on the road's edge, or his wind tips, tips lashing at the bars in zoos. He preferred to box his way down the back streets of every great port. The one time he fell, old sea dogs licked iron from his wounds. The gull is above the city. Surfing the sky's rollers, he traces slate to dock. Years back, he knocked great slabs of ice from a herring boat's mast, knowing the vessel would soon keel. The wind is rising. When the incoming gale bludgeons the coast, the gull will continue to fuck on the edge of a high cliff. <laughs> 